Hi everyone, Aaron here for Zolotech, and it's been a few days since iOS 11 Gold Master has been out. Now the Gold Master, for those of you that aren't familiar with it, is basically the final beta version before it comes out to the public on the 19th. So this will be out September 19th, and I've been using it since Tuesday with no problems whatsoever. So it's working really well. I'm getting pretty good battery life, uh, basically the same I was getting on iOS 10.3.3 and some of the other betas where I got really good battery life. Now there is still 3D touch lag, and I don't know if this is going to be fixed ever or what, but this really is something that's pretty annoying and maybe isn't fixed on this version or it will never be fixed. We're not really sure at this point, but hopefully it's fixed on things like iOS or iPhone 8 rather and iPhone 10. So I'll be checking both of those out when I can, when they're available, and we'll see how it runs on that. As far as everything else goes, it seems pretty stable. There is a few times when it lags here and there. If I'm scrolling, it'll stutter a little bit and then it works fine. But most of the time it's really smooth and really fluid. All the new features are working fine. The new control center is working well and it seems like everything's very well set and nailed down. I'm not sure if we're ever going to see the message in the cloud option with this particular version. I'm assuming that's coming to iOS 11.1 .1 since they pushed that off. We still don't have the peer-to-peer -peer Apple Pay where I can pay someone else. At least I've not seen it work anywhere. And so maybe that'll come out when the iPhone 10 comes out, or maybe it will come out before with iPhone 8. We're not really sure, and I'll keep you updated on that. With iOS 11, of course, I'll be doing other videos to give you tips and things like that. And those will be coming soon, but if you have any that you'd like to see specifically, I've had a few of you message me on Twitter at my Zolotech uh, Twitter feed and directly message me. I'd love to hear what you have to say if there's something specifically that you want. Everything else, though, seems to be working well. Uh, it's fluid and smooth and I have no issues with it now except for that little jitter there's some weird graphical things from time to time and hopefully that gets nailed down with the final maybe they'll tweak the build number now for those of you that want to upgrade from the gold master to the final version don't delete the beta profile just yet many times the beta is the same or the gold master is the same as the final version and all you need to do is delete the profile but we won't know that until the final comes out because sometimes they do a second gold master and so the current gold master is uh, okay it seems to be all right with the, with the exception of those few issues that i'm experiencing but if we see that there's something else that they or they feel there's something else they need to release they'll release a second gold master and if they do that then we're going to see different build numbers. So hold off on deleting that beta profile just yet. And once the final comes out, if it's the same build, just delete the beta profile and you've already got it. There is no update. If it's a different number, then you'll need to update and just delete the beta profile to do that and then restart and then update. So it's not that complicated. And if you're not familiar with how to delete the beta profile, you just go into settings, then you go to general, scroll all the way to the bottom, go to profile, tap on the profile and hit remove and that's it reboot and that's how you remove it so other than that though it's been pretty good let me know your experience in the comments below if you haven't subscribed already please subscribe and like as always thanks for watching this is aaron i'll see you next time